Southern Charities Bakery, Southern Charities Bakery. Yes, Dawns and Divas, I have finally gotten, I believe, the light in such a manner that it's not illuminating behind me or being bright as I don't know what in front of me. Yeah, so got that together. So that's what we're going to do now. Boom. Ipsy. January. Mm -hmm. The unveiling. Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. This is the call. This is the call. This is the call. Yes, it says Metropolis. Metropolis. I thought that was Gotham City. I don't remember New York being Gotham City. I don't know. Is it Gotham? Is New York also known as Gotham City? I don't know. Anyway, you are now entering the metropolis. Yes. And they, I'm guessing they did something in New York or whatever the case may be because that is the bridge. The bridge is over. The bridge is over. The bridge is over. The bridge is over. Urban glamour. Because backseat beauty tutorials and regular tutorials. Yes. Mm-hmm. So they're going to give us the 411. What's the 411, hun? What's the 411? You got it going on. I guess you got it going on. What's the 411, hun? What's the 411? Do, 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 do. Ba, do, do. Yes. Now, first off, straight off the bat, I love the color. I love this silvery gray color. So, for that, I love the bag. However, the bag smells like it just got a fresh coat of spray paint. That's what it smells like. It's not coming off on my hands, but it smells like a fresh coat of funky spray paint. Now, if you're a person who likes spray paint, this may be... A wonderful smell for you because you know there are some people out there they like spray paint and 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 the smell of gas and the smell of a uh, glue and the smell of um what is it marker permanent markers and stuff there are people out there that like that the smell of ink and all that kind of stuff I'm not one of those people it smells like it smells like plastic or fresh fresh spray fresh spray paint yeah, that's what it smells like. But in any case, let's open it up. Do, do, do. And let's dig in and see the first item. Because I didn't, I have not opened this up. I got this, I think, like two weeks ago. But I did not open it up. So today, we are going to open it up and see, boom, together. Okay, this is not, uh, has no packaging on it. But this says Katie with a heart. It's pink. It's hard to see because the lights. Thought I had it. Thought I had the light, y'all. Okay, well, how about we just turn the light off? Oh, gosh. Now it's dark as I don't know what. Okay. trying to get y'all to see it there it is there you go yeah now it says that the color is clear look at the top I want y'all to see that uh, thing on the top there there you go see it okay I think it's Katy Perry maybe I don't know has a slight, it's very slight vanilla. And this is a lip balm, which I can't put on my lips even though I already have. I can put it on my lips and I can see anything because it's clear. So see how it glides. 
glides on smoothly. Smells a little, a little light vanilla, but a little bit more flower perfumey. I like it. I like it. I really, really like it. Next up. Okay, we have, next up is Naked Cosmetics. Boom. And the color is Desert Desert Sunset. Can we open it? Okay, it's still. Yeah, this is very ghetto. I'm very yeah. I'm not a, a makeup artist or anything like that. I don't do makeup tutorials, so I mean, hey, whatever. And if the last person that touched this or whatever the case may be had uh, journey hands. Oh well. I'm trying to oh, I'm trying to pull it apart, but you have to twist. Duh. Oh, good thing I didn't push it over. It's powdery inside. I can't. I don't know if I can hold it up in such a way to be able to see. Can, yeah, I can see that a little powdery inside. So it's a good thing I didn't toss it over or whatever the case may be because I didn't. No. Now what is it? Naked Industries, it says Desert Sunset. I don't know what it is. I'm assuming it's for the eyes. I don't know. Maybe it's a bronzer. I don't know. But such a small uh, thing, I'm assuming it's eyeshadow. Okay, next is Temp Temp 2. Temp 2. What is temp to? It says base, smooth, and matted primer. So it's a primer. A primer for what? I don't know. I don't exactly say. I don't know if it's a primer for all over the face. It's got a little ball inside, I guess, to keep it um keep it moving liquid liquidated. Can y'all see that ball? Yeah. Liquidated, okay, you know, liquefied or moving smoothly. I don't know. So I don't know if it's for all over the face. I don't know if it's for just the eyes. I don't know. I'm a, I would assume it's for just the eyes because, you know, it, and that would make sense to go with the eyeshadow. But, you know, hey, I don't know. Okay, next is 417 Hand Moisturizer. The packaging is like a tan brown kind of color. Like I said, never opened this, so it's got the on top. So let's just open it up right now so that we can smell it. It's a little thick. See it coming out? Ooh, thick. It's a thick cream. Try to push it back down in there. It's a thick cream. It smells very perfumey. Ooh. Yes, this is definitely for the hands. Don't put this on your face, y'all, because it's very perfumey. Definitely very perfumey. I mean, I wouldn't suggest you put it on your face. It says hand moisturizer, and that is what I believe you should use it for, your hands, because it is very Floral perfumey. And if you have sensitive skin, it may break you out. Let me see what. Oh my gosh. Looks like it's written in Russian and some other languages or something. I don't know. Anyway, moving on. Last but not least. Oh, it's a brush. I'm assuming this is a eyeshadow brush which would make sense to this being eyeshadow which would make sense to be to this being eye primer which would make sense because I am definitely if you didn't know an eye and lip person so this whole 
package really makes sense to me. Now, before I used to complain about um, not getting any um, makeup brushes, and now it seems like every package I get a makeup brush. So I guess I did a great job of changing over my uh, status because you do have to fill out something, which is great. You do have to fill out a um, status when you do this Ipsy, when you do these Ipsy bags. And you can change them up. Like, you know, they try, they have different um, makeup artists and then they ask you which one do you most um, familiarize yourself, not familiarize yourself, but which one do you think, um, what's the word I'm looking for? What's the, what's, what is the one that best speaks to your preferences and how you, how you feel that you look, you know? So, yeah. So, of course, I picked the woman who is the darkest of all of them because, as you see, I am dark skinned. So, I picked the woman who is the darkest of all of them so that way, most likely, I get products that are suitable to my dark skin. Yes. Anyway, Frugal Diva, have a Frugal Diva day. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, don't know what you're waiting for. Until next time, some mooches, dogs and